Queens of Eagles is bidding of the Leo Reno Award based upon their commitment to education, their commitment to building strong futures of Native people and Native students within our community. The Dreams of Eagles Native American Education Day brings to the metro area some examples of the intertribal history that we do have in the state of Nebraska and we get to appreciate their culture through the activities that they provide. They have impacted children of all socioeconomic backgrounds and cultural backgrounds in the fourth grade as they learn about Native American culture, heritage, customs, history. We have four teepees in there representing the four tribes, Ponca, Winnebago, Omaha, and Sioux. And there's someone in at those teepees explaining their particular tribal heritage. We have uh, dancers dressed in regalia. And we had 32 uh, native stations uh, where we had people that introduced things such as uh, quilt work, medicine, various cultural things dealing with native people. And the fourth graders would rotate. I'm actually Native American a little bit, so it's kind of cool to learn about my own culture and see what they did. You don't see very many different cultures when you just live your everyday, go to school, do homework, hang out with friends. So this field trip gave us a chance to see what other people do. Exposing kids when they're really young to like this group of people and like embracing that is like a part of our history. It's one thing to read about Native Americans in a book and see what the author thinks about them. But it's completely different to actually like go and see what their culture is like and see their different customs. Today we're doing a mini education days. We're going to show you some of the things we have. We've uh, we've accrued and we've made. It can be fully beaded. We'll give the kids an introduction. They'll come and they'll go around to four different stations for a little presentation. And then at the end, we're going to include the kids in a Native American round dance. We can say with confidence that 4,000 kids got a touch of Native experience each and every year. And Dreams of Eagles want students to know about the cultural aspects of Native Americans and that we still are here in this city and in this country. One, two, three. There you go, good. Uda. Uda means good. What an ambitious project, exposing every single fourth grader in the Omaha Public Schools to the heritage and culture of Native Americans and Alaska Natives. Dreams of Eagles is an intertribal organization, and as we just witnessed, their Native American Indian Education Day has become an outstanding success. Accepting the 2012 Leo Riano Memorial Award, on behalf of the Dream of Eagles, is their president and founder, Cleo Frazier, and their treasurer, Shelley Winjack. On behalf of Dreams of Eagles organization, I would like to express our sincere gratitude and thanks to the NEA for presenting us with the Leo Riano Human and Civil Rights Award. The Dreams of Eagles organization was founded in March of 1993 and attained its 501c3 status in 2003. We are represented by 26 different tribes, including one Alaskan native. The founders of our group recognized the need for organized cultural activities and classes to help Native people living in the urban setting to maintain their cultural traditions. Over the years, we have expanded our teaching out into the non-Native communities, holding beating classes, providing cultural education, and performing demonstrations to schools and other groups. We understood early that the key to ending discrimination is education.
have found there is a tremendous amount of interest today in Native American culture and history. Once again, thank you very much.